Are you kidding me? Oh my god. Well, do we need to chat? I'll give you something else to do. Here, play with my nipple covers. So if you're wondering what second pregnancies are like, uh, for me, really tired. I also feel like a little disconnected with you guys because I'm now 28 weeks pregnant. <gasps> Woo! This pregnancy's gone by so fast. We're just like not ready. Oh, 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 oh. Is that a bug? I am so disgusted right now. Look what I just found in my bed. Ew. That's a dead earwig. Ew. I want to throw up right now. Oh, my skin is crawling. Ew, ew. Ew, 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 ew. I'm mortified right now. That was disgusting. And I saw him the other night in the shower, like on the ceiling, and I thought, he better not come and crawl on me in the middle of the night. I closed the door and then I haven't seen him since and he's been in our bed. Ugh. I hate earwigs. I would rather a little spider in our bed than an earwig. I think that means I should wash my sheets. It's like a sign. <laughs> So I think the moral of the story is if you see a spider or an earwig in your bathroom or in your house before you go to sleep, kill it. Get rid of it because it's gonna end up in your bed the next morning. It's seriously frightening. By the way, this never happens. I did not take my makeup off last night. Not that I was wearing a lot, but I was wearing mascara and like some blush. Did not take it off. Also, burned my hand pretty bad the other day. So that's what that is. I was so tired last night. I brushed my teeth, but did not take my makeup off, which probably happens once a year or when I'm pregnant. <laughs> Goodbye, mascara. Oh, I feel so much better. In case you're wondering what I'm using, I wash my face with, this is actually my friend's uh, face cleanser from Hello Joyous. I really like it, but if you do have makeup on, I feel like you have to do like an oil pre-cleanse before that. It's a very gentle, non-drying face uh, cleanser. This Drunk Elephant Vitamin C. And then I'm going in with my trio here from Luminance Skincare. I believe they just reactivated my discount code. I've been using them probably for 10 years, like my favorite skincare brand, all natural, amazing qualities. Doing eye cream. Like, I feel like I noticed the biggest difference in my skin when I use them. This is their peptide serum. I believe they're changing their name to Lucera now. I think they had like issues trying to copyright the other meme, so it's the best skincare. When I had horrible hormonal acne, this is what saved my skin. And then this is their premium moisturizer with amino proteins. So moisturizing and go all the way down to the chest that's what I'm trying to do now okay let's go wake up Sage and then I'll finish getting ready and dressed and figure out breakfast hi hi honey oh we're Sage we're Sage uh oh Cashy's coming to get you she's coming she's coming Girls. I wash it too. It's what? That one's going I wash it. horizontal. <laughs> go potty. Let's go potty. Oh, go potty. I'm going to do a whole video on our potty training experience, but we are slowly, slowly getting there. Are you, oh, what are you saying? What? My turn. Your turn. Oh, she wants to vlog. Do you see daddy? Well, say hi, daddy. Daddy. Uh, say, what are you doing? I'm doing. I'm cleaning up your room. <coughs> well, <coughs> do we need to chat? Baby, baby. Baby, baby. Ugh. <coughs> Ew. Everything makes me nauseous in the mornings. Can mommy make her her morning coffee? 
Mm. You want mommy to put that in there? Thank you. Mine? Okay, wait. Mine! Put that one in there. Let's do another scoop. Mommy needs energy. This is just collagen. Okay. Oh, thank you. No. No, we don't. We just need two. We just need two. I'll give you something else to do. Here, play with my nipple covers. No, it doesn't go in there. Okay, you gonna Put count? One, two, three. Now this is hot. This is hot. This is hot. Careful. Hot. This is how I've been making my ice herbal coffee every single morning. So I just add my herbal coffee, collagen, stevia, hot water, and I do it in a small mug. And wow, some ice. You fill up a large mason jar with tons of ice. Matt thinks it's overkill, but it's not. Um, you need it to cool down the Don't hot coffee. It. <laughs> Perfect. You try it. Okay, ready? Ready for this ASMR? Oh, you gonna try it? <laughs> I like it. You don't like it? Mommy drinks this twice a day. It's so good. It's okay. You're too little for coffee. So tired. Um, yesterday I woke up, it was like 7.30 I woke up and then Matt decided to take the girls to the PARK. And I kid you not, I think it was 9.30. I'd been up for two hours, guys. All I did was make pancakes and eat them. And I had a na an hour nap on the couch at 9.30. Like, so if you're wondering what second pregnancies are like, <laughs> uh, for me, really tired. I've just been so tired. Like. With, when I was pregnant with Sage, I remember getting this like burst of energy in my second trimester and I was waiting for that in this pregnancy and when you have already a child <laughs> using up a lot of your energy and just like your day to day, like I'm working, I'm exercising, I'm trying to do all the things and you just like, you get tired quick. When I was pregnant with Sage, I would have probably been done for the night. Like say six o'clock, I would have just chilled on the couch. No one would have asked me to do anything. And now that's like prime, like dinner, bedtime, all that stuff with Sage. And I'm so tired. Usually every day at 2 p.m. I get pretty sleepy. And then I usually don't take a nap. Yeah! I'm not really a napper. And someone so rudely said to me, I think it was actually on a YouTube short that the reason I'm so tired is because I am selfish and I work out while pregnant and then I have zero energy for Sage. I'm like, I'm sorry, Mommy. what? I need to work out because it makes me feel good Mommy. mentally and physically and so Mommy. I can pick up, so I can do this. So I can pick up this girl. This girl's not light. Mommy? Yes. Also feel like a little disconnected with you guys because I'm now 28 weeks pregnant and it's crazy. Like I'm, I think I'm technically in my third trimester. So I feel like the second trimester just like whizzed by and we've just, you know, been soaking up all the time with Seiji and it's been amazing, but also exhausting. And this is probably my favorite age so far. I just like she is talking so much, she's so silly. I'm finally cooking more. I The nausea is so much better. I feel like more like me, but Dr. also very pregnant. So it's just like, I'm tired, Dr. I'm slower, I'm heavier. Dr. Anyways, that's the update. Also, I feel like we just need to declutter our house. We have done zero prep for baby number two. Like we're trying to figure out which room the nursery is gonna go into. And I just, I'm in that like, I'm starting to get into that nesting mode where I just feel like there's so much stuff everywhere. I wanna declutter, I want it out of the house, I wanna organize and just start like getting ready for baby number two. Cause I feel like this pregnancy has gone by so fast. We're just like not ready. And I know like, honestly, I didn't really start prepping with when I was pregnant with Sage until the third trimester anyways. I feel like we just have a lot to do and these next like 10 weeks are gonna go by so fast. Hey Sage? What? So fast. So fast. So fast. <laughs> we got this little tea set for a photo shoot for the toddler cookbook and she loves it. We've been doing play tea time like all the time. Oh, 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 they're all falling off. Okay, they're very ripe. 
This shop. Yeah, this mommy's cookbook. We're gonna make my fluffy gluten-free pancakes from Pickle. my cookbook. Pickle. Like that, okay, and like this. Good job. You might need to crack it more. Yeah. <gasps> Woo! Okay, just a little bit, a little bit. Oh, good job. Mix. No. Oh, okay. Okay, mix, mix, mix. Put some oil. One, we're just gonna eyeball this. Two. What are doing? It's avocado oil. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, let's give it a good mix. I tried. Uh, no thank you. Oh. Hang on, hang on. We gotta measure. One cup. Okay, put that in. Oh, eat. No, that's not gonna taste yummy yet. Go get some cinnamon. And I'll do the salt, it's just a little bit. Mommy will measure first and then you dump it. I'll try. No, 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 not yet, not yet. I'll try. But we don't wanna over mix, so that's probably good. And we'll add blueberries. Finger. Okay, try with your finger. Look at all the blueberries we got. We got even more in the fridge. Hey, stop eating it. No, 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 no. I'll eat. No, it's not, I don't know why you, you're I'll like. I'll Go, boop, you gotta make the noise. Boop. 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 boop, 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 Don't even come at me with the raw batter because like, we all did it. <laughs> okay, let's mix it though. Okay, don't eat too much because it's gonna upset your, your tummy, okay? Okay, mix. Tummy. Yeah. Yeah. You wanna see? Sure. You collecting them? No, two. Them for daddy? No, one. Okay, pancake stack. Oh, are you giving her morning hug? Oh, that's a rat. Is that a bug? No, yeah, bug. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm dressed. I'm already feeling like I could use a nap, but I'm going to go take the girls out for a nice walk. It's gorgeous outside. Matt's going to the gym, so we're both getting our activity in for the day. I'm not even gonna worry about her hair. I'm just gonna put a hat on. That's what I'm doing. We're good. And then when we get back, we probably have to do a cleanup of the house, do lunch, and then Sage is doing swimming lessons today before her nap. Are we excited for a walk? She's in a funny mood this morning. Oh, I, I just get tired after I eat. And uh, yeah, I'm sleepy. But you know what? Moving my body, getting some fresh air will help wake me up. Yeah. What do you have? You got giraffes? Oh, you got two? Are they sisters? Oh, it's hot out. Thank you. Oh, we gotta brush that hair. I am sweating. By the way, that's cashew panting in the background. I think we were gone for maybe an hour. This is what I mean, like just going for an hour walk, pushing the stroller, also navigating Cashew because she kept barking at, well like dogs behind fences are so annoying when you're walking with your dog and you're like la 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 la. And all of a sudden, it's when there's like two dogs. There's two spots in my neighborhood where there's like two little dogs and Cashew is never the first one to bark. She's just like not a barker. We got really lucky. But if there's two dogs and they start barking at her behind a fence, she loses it. I think she thinks she's like protecting us. So I got like one hand on the stroller, one hand like holding back Cashew. It was a workout. Like <laughs> that happened twice. Let me show you Cashew, she's dead. Is it hot, girly? Yeah. Hey, Jack. <laughs> just wanting to do my hair ow. ow okay gentle gentle with mommy's hair I want brush my hair. you want to brush my hair oh what <laughs> thank you 
Is that dry shampoo? Oh, Thank you. I let my hair air dry yesterday, and so it's like really crazy today. Okay. I'm at the salon. I watch movie. Oh, you watch movie? Oh, here you go. Oh, okay. Say thank you, Daddy. Thank you, Daddy. You're welcome, Missy. Daddy brought us smoothies. Cheers. Cheers. She loves this smoothie, eh? I actually have a version of the smoothie because she loves it so much. It's like an oatmeal cookie smoothie. I have a version of it in the toddler cookbook because it's like her favorite. That's you stole daddy. daddy's smoothie? <laughs> she goes over and says, Daddy, I got your smoothie. This place is a mess. This is really what it looks like. Matt's doing the dishes. I'm going to help him out. <laughs> what, the house or me helping? You helping. Oh, stop. Facts. <laughs> yeah, Matt is the one who does the dishes most of the time. And then I make delicious food. I got a foodie. You got a smoothie. Yeah. I don't know why, but when I was pregnant with Sage, I was always so hot. And then this time, I'm like chilly. boiling I have to take the sweater off but we are just about to head to swim a little bit of a mission to sometimes get sage in the car it's like she didn't want to put her crocs on because they were dirty and then Matt washed them and then she's like they're wet so it's just like things like that that sometimes take extra long to leave the house oh I think we're gonna do a little bit more cleaning while sage is napping I think our issue is we really don't have a day of the week that we just do like a reset and a clean out of the house like just to reset it exactly what that means for the week I feel like because of that it just accumulates and there's just like junk everywhere and things aren't being put away and like we're cleaning but it's not organized so that's kind of our issue and it's just like irritating me right now and I feel like I just need like everything decluttered and put away and I think we're also going to start packing up the guest bedroom putting the office in there and then the office is going to be the nursery so that's also on our list so okay I gotta take this sweater off I'm boiling it was cold inside it's hot outside summer problems <laughs> so swim lessons during nap time not ideal we left uh with a few screams although she did have a good time but it just wasn't good planning she Matt just put her down for her nap and she's like fighting it a bit this peach from the farmer's market mm. Nothing like the Georgian peaches we got when we were in Florida, but it's pretty good. We're going to do some organizing and just start nesting. If you guys want me to do like a full video on like either a weekly reset or nesting, getting ready for baby number two, let me know. But like I was saying, this pregnancy is going by so fast, which in a way is good because I had Sage in 2020 and it felt like the longest year ever. And I was just like, depressed and uncomfortable and just like it was just my first pregnancy and I was just feeling all the emotions like this time people actually see me pregnant when I was pregnant with Sage you know how many people didn't even see me pregnant they like maybe saw me at my baby shower and then it was like Sage was here and I was a mom or they didn't see me at all and I was a mom so it felt like this very weird I don't know like I just became a mom out of nowhere and like I wasn't actually pregnant but I documented it online and I have a birth vlog to prove it but some days I'm like wow this is going by so fast and then when I'm uncomfortable I'm like oh my goodness how much longer do I have and because I know what's to come it's just like okay like get prepped and ready for it mentally and at the same time like I don't know how many kids Matt and I want to have or how many kids I want to carry so this might be our last pregnancy so I also don't want to rush it and I want to even when I'm uncomfortable I just want to appreciate it and not want it to pass by too quickly and also at the same time when I am like uncomfortable and tired I also think about Sage will never be two and a half again and this is such an important time in her life just her being little and like just, I don't know, like 
every stage, I guess, of her growing up is going to be exciting and fun, but I'm just really enjoying the twos. And yes, they're like emotionally draining. Like we left the swimming place, like with her screaming, I was saying to Matt, you either like get upset and mad and worked up about it, or you just laugh it off. And like, we put her in a car seat and we're just like, okay, tire yourself out for your nap. And we just kind of laugh to ourselves. Like, oh my goodness. Like you either cry or you laugh. <laughs> I feel like this is breaking in me vlogging again because like I said I just haven't vlogged in a while. I'm on Instagram and TikTok and stuff every week so follow me there. All right that's it for today's vlog. I'll see you guys in the next one. Mm. Peaches man. Is it peach season?